this word is everywhere. It pops on the covers of countless books, magazines, articles. It comes from the lips of countless people, speakers and teachers. It's a goal for many, but at the same time, it can cause stress. The word is passion. A lot of people are under the wrong assumption that there is only one true passion out there. Everyone has it, and if you'll find it, you will succeed. And if you don't, you'll fail. When you were asked as a small child, what is your passion, you would answer right away. Painting, dancing, writing. But mine was singing. In fact, I was so passionate about my singing that I used to have singing lessons and even participated in different competitions and musicals. However, when I was 12, my passion for singing suffered from a sudden death. So there I was, passionateless. And now that I'm 16, I still find this question extremely hard and difficult. I'm still passionateless. Is there something wrong with me? Is it hidden somewhere? Where and how do I find it? Once during a class, a teacher asked each of the students to write down the list of things we like to do or feel passionate about. And that was the moment when I realized that I didn't know what to write. I thought that I had to come up with a very good and interesting answer, but I couldn't. And I thought that there was something wrong with me. However, the thing is that teenagers like you and I have a very limited history and experience, so the overall idea of finding a passion just puts a lot of pressure on us, don't you think? We are waiting for that passion to arrive. We think, hope, and wait. But let me tell you the truth. Passion demands action. So the first thing that you have to do in order to find your passion is to change your source of dopamine. According to American Psychological Societies, dopamine is the chemical that is being released by our brains. It motivates us to do things, and it makes us feel passionate. Back in the days to get this dopamine, people had to do different things. In most of the cases, it meant creating something, making a painting, building a dollhouse, writing a poem. However, today's problem is that dopamine is too easy to find. It's cheap and it's evident everywhere. People get it without any effort. Surf the web, watch Netflix, check Instagram. And these are the things that teenagers do every day. And this became our main source of dopamine. So, in order to find my passion, I decided to go on a passion hunt. I searched up a list of hobbies and picked out the ones that seemed interesting and fun, and I would do these activities for two weeks every single day. So, first of all, I signed up in the cross-country club, where I ran for a few kilometers every single day, and even participated in the competition. It was fun, but at the same time kind of hard, so I couldn't really call it my passion. Plus, there were more things to try. Next, I chose Chinese and Italian, and I allocated around one hour studying this too, and as a result, I can say some basic fra phrases like ciao and ni hao. <laughs> Next, I chose arts, and I decided to sketch different things like nature, people, and architecture. So overall, for each of these activities, I allocated around one hour, and I would always keep track of the time, and when the time was up, I would be done. However, with one activity, I would just lose track of myself in time. It could be 2.30 in the morning, and I would just realize that I've been doing this thing for five hours, and this thing was arts. While engaging myself in this different variety of activities, I learned things about myself I never would have known had I started this passion hunt. The picture of my abilities became more vivid and clear, eventually guiding me towards the thing I like and love to do, to make art. So I want you to put down your phones and close your laptops and engage in your life right now. I want you to become passionate about the things you like to do. Finding a passion is not something you do in one day you have to make an effort to find time and opportunities. And remember, passion, passion demands action. Thank you.